Hey guys, so I hope you all are having a great day and in this video I will show you how you can install the official Android 8.1 firmware on your Redmi Note 5 Pro. So basically this is an Indian Redmi Note 5 Pro which is running the latest Android 7.1.1 Nougat which is of course the latest in Indian markets. So basically we are going to install the official Android 8.1 beta firmware on the Redmi Note 5 Pro. At this time we are not going to install the Chinese firmware because the Chinese firmware has quite a few bugs and a website named Funky Huawei got their hands on the latest global beta firmware of Android 8.1 and that firmware has a tons of new features and even the dual Vo LT is working so we are going to install that firmware on the Indian Redmi Note 5 Pro so as you can see it is the Indian Redmi Note 5 Pro which is actually made in China but yeah that doesn't matter you can see it is powered by the 4 gb of ram and snapdragon 636 it is the legit and original redmi note 5 pro this is not the chinese variant in case you feel that it is the chinese variant so yeah first off your redmi note 5 pro should be unlocked and i have already made a video on how to unlock the redmi note 5 pro and i really feel sorry for you guys you guys are not able to unlock the bootloader because of xiaomi's stupid unlock policies and i don't know how to solve that 86 something error i only got a single error and that i solved via vpn so i really really don't know how to solve that error so yeah you will need to unlock the bootloader of your redmi note 5 pro and yeah that's the only way to flash the fast boot and recovery room so you can check if your smartphone is unlocked or not by going to developers option and they are just select the me unlock status and the device is unlocked so as you can see my device is already unlocked and yeah it took me around 15 days i already made a guide on how to unlock the bootloader also you will need to have a twrp recovery installed installation of twrp is pretty simple and i have already made a specific guide on how to install the twrp recovery so go check that video out only tough task is to grab a redmi note 5 pro from the flash sales and second is to unlock the bootloader if you have completed these two things then you are ready to install twrp recovery so now the important part how you can install the official android 8.1 global beta on your redmi note 5 pro on your indian redmi note 5 pro or any redmi note 5 pro doesn't matter at all so i'm opening the explorer to show you guys which files you need right now as you can see in the internal storage, I have these two files, the MIUI 8.1 zip. So you have to download it. Thanks to funkyhuabi.com for this file. It's of 1.59 GB and you also have to download the lazy flasher for no variety check. And yeah, these two files need to be downloaded. All the links are in the below description box. So go download these two files. And yes, your Redmi Note 5 Pro should be running on the official 7.1.1 Nougat. If you have already downloaded and installed the Chinese 8.1 firmware, you have to downgrade your Redmi Note 5 Pro to 7.1.1. I did the same because the global beta 8.1 is not installing on the Chinese 8.1 firmware. So basically now you have to boot to the TWRP recovery mode. And for doing that, you have to power off your smartphone. Then you have to press the volume up key and the power button at the same time. And now the question is if this firmware will wipe all your data, I don't think so. We will see right now as you can see, but the developer says it is not going to wipe your data. So first off, you have to install the 8.1 firmware right away. Yeah, there is no need to wipe anything, the cache memory or the data or system. Just flash this firmware right away. And this is called the recovery installation method. There's another method, the fast boot installation method, which you can do if you have the full firmware image of the Redmi Note 5 Pro. This is called the recovery installation method if you don't know. Okay, so now you have to do is select back and then you have to flash the lazy flasher. So now you have to reboot your smartphone and select do not install. I 
I hope it boots because it is the first time I am installing this firmware right away in front of the camera. And according to me, it is not going to wipe your data. So as you can see, we have successfully installed the official Android 8.1 firmware on the Redmi Note 5 Pro. The brightness is pretty low. Okay, I'll wait one second. So I think everything is working great. Let's check the settings section and there we have the about phone and yeah it is running the official android 8.1.0 guys just look at that beautiful operating system let's check out if we have the full screen gestures or not okay so yeah we have the full screen gestures also and i really love that feature guys you have to learn first in order to use these features I already know how this thing will work so I'm used to it I'm done okay so we also have the full screen gestures and let's check if we have the dual vo LTE system or not this XJ developer reported that it has the dual vo LTE I cannot check right now because I don't have dual geo sim right now but I will in future I will review this room and there I will show you that it definitely has the dual vo LTE there is also an option of dual 4G and you can also use the vo LTE on your secondary sim so I think that is the dual vo LTE part now let's use the picture in picture which I think is new in this global beta firmware let's open CNN video I hope it is visible to you guys let me know in the below comment section if you are liking this video also in future if the MIUI 10 comes I will be the first reviewing this firmware reviewing the MIUI 10 or any other firmware which the Redmi Note 5 Pro gets so if you are new to this channel make sure to subscribe so to use the picture in picture mode all you have to do is just click on that computer like icon and there we have the video and picture in picture so you can use anything while watching that video for example i have to go to the settings and there i have to show that it is running the official android 8.1 and there we go the video is also playing in the background so that's the picture in picture mode and yeah it is working great you can close it from here or you can double tap it if you want to open the full screen again so this is all with the installation process of the official Android 8.1 firmware on the Redmi Note 5 Pro and I have already reviewed the official Android 8.1 on the Redmi Note 5 Pro so go check that video out and thanks for watching this video I hope you enjoyed this don't forget to like subscribe and yeah peace out